Matthew White. This man gave the police a false alibi. One of his relatives claims that he, Matthew White, told them he'd been present that night. Is he the sixth suspect? Morning, sir. It's Peter Sharp from 3 Test G. Mm -hmm. No inquiries regarding the murder uh, of Stephen Lawrence. The police likely invited journalists to film their initial inquiries back in 1993. But in the end, the effort they wanted the public to see fell flat. The McPherson report found that the investigation into Stephen Lawrence's murder had been marred by professional incompetence, institutional racism and a failure of leadership. Now a BBC investigation has prompted the Met to state that the impact of early mistakes continues to be seen. These were the five prime suspects. Gary Dobson and David Norris, both given life sentences for murder in 2012. Brothers Neil and Jamie Acourt and Luke Knight weren't convicted. And this new investigation suggests that Matthew White was central to the case. Police had surveillance photos that resembled eyewitness accounts of a fair-haired attacker. And there were multiple missed opportunities in their pursuit of White as a line of inquiry. The Metropolitan Police says that Matthew White was first arrested in the year 2000. He denied any involvement in the murder. Thirteen years later, he was arrested for a second time, after a relative of White was found who provided new information. On both occasions, prosecutors declared there was no realistic prospect of conviction. In 2020, White was spoken to again by investigators. He died a year later and the investigation has been inactive since then. The Lawrence family have had to go through years and years uh, of discovering, yet further failings from the police service, deep institutional, uh, racially driven failings, and uh, today's yet another example of that. In this footage, Baroness Doreen Lawrence walks behind the mayor at a memorial service marking three decades since her son's murder. She's calling for serious sanctions against the police officers who failed to investigate Matthew White. The police say the impact of the racist murder of Stephen Lawrence and attack on his friend Dwayne Brooks continues to be felt throughout policing. And on the receiving end of fresh revelations and reiterated apologies, a family unable to alter their circumstances but always hoping for change.